Welcome to the Crypto Minute. According to a recent Grayscale report, one in four people with investable income have Bitcoin exposure. Both the Maxwell trial and Nancy Pelosi portfolio accounts got suspended on Twitter. Not nice. BitMart was hacked for $200 million. Gemini partner with Columbia's largest bank. So I guess Bitcoin is dead. Be all right. I mean, your grandpa and I are doing, um, what, what do the kids call it? Hodling? Uh, oh, well, you better snap out of it, dear. I mean, you'll never make any friends if you have lettuce hands. Just in, Australia has reportedly seen a spike in its citizens owning Bitcoin. It's my party and I'll cry if I want to. Would cry too if it happened to you. The former Google CEO is now a strategic advisor for Chainlink Labs. El Salvador bought the dip again. WhatsApp is testing stablecoin payments in the US. I guess AOC doesn't own any. Greed index went to 16, signaling extreme fear. The third largest Bitcoin whale bought the dip with another $137 million. The AI robot Sophie will be tokenized for metaverse appearances. According to Grayscale, the number of new crypto investors that started in 2021 make up about 55%. Keep stacking and I'll see you next week.